Hey guys, so today I have a new reusable gel ice pack that I'm going to check out for the very first time on camera. So let's get started. So as you can see, it's still 100% packed and sealed. Has the instructions on the back clearly labeled. So this gel pack should be good for your lower back, your neck, your knee, your elbow. But really anywhere that you would normally use a gel pack to begin with. The good thing about this is that you can use it for cold or hot application. You're not limited to just one. So let's go ahead and get started and see how this looks for the first time. So as you can see, we have the tape here. I'm gonna go ahead and just carefully cut it open. Ceramic blades, so I don't have to worry about actually cutting anything but the package. All right, come right on out and Go ahead and see. So, warranty and safety guide right here. If you're missing yours, here is the QR code if you want to go ahead and take mine. But that's just so that way you can go ahead and get the information that you may need. It looks like this might be a storage bag to keep it in just in case, you know, you don't have a proper way to store it. Just keep your, your gel pack in good condition, clean the usual so the gel pad itself it has a little bit of weight to it but it's not too heavy you can actually feel the gel and I can really easily move it around um, because our weather has turned cold and it was delivered in the cold it actually retained some of that cool air which is pretty good for being in a box so I'm pretty impressed and Let's see, so for cold application, you'll store the gel pack in the freezer and refrigerate for at least two hours. Um, you could just leave it in the freezer if you tend to use cold more. If you use both, then I'd leave it out. But for hot application, they have a hot water method where you could put it in basically boiling water or you could use the microwave. Um, you're gonna wanna need the gel evenly to make sure like it, dis it dispersed the heat evenly. And of course, there is a time intervals for how long you should put the gel pack in each microwave based off of your microwave wattage settings. So just to kind of show you a size comparison from after I opened it, you can see just kind of up close the actual padding. So it's about the size, maybe give or take, of printer paper, a bit bigger than some printer paper. Uh, to, and you can see my arm. It's good arm's length. Goes from right here all the way up to about my elbow. Feels really relieving, actually, if I'm being honest. Um, if you need to, you can actually hold it if you need to. And you can rest it for your shoulder, maybe your neck, lower back, if you need to sit up on that. But just so you can kind of see offhand first hand experience a close-up of the actual gel mat. So I went ahead and gave the gel pack a try. I went ahead and heated it up in the microwave and then I kneaded it around as the direction said. And for my purposes, I put it like this on my shoulder just to kind of see, just to test it to see if it would hold heat, feel comfortable and whatnot. It feels nice. Obviously, you know, balancing wise, you're depending on how you're going to use it, you might need to hold it in place or put pressure up against something to hold your pat the gel padding in place but otherwise like as far as holding the heat it actually holds it for a pretty good amount of time it's still warm it's still uh working well and it's been at least 30 minutes at this point so it definitely does as it says as far as the heating goes so next up i'm going to end up freezing it and going that method same thing though as far as it goes you freeze it I'm not a fan of cold too much, so, and we just got the cold weather in, so that's going to be probably a summertime experiment for me. But the heat definitely retains the heat. Feels great for my shoulder, very relaxing, and it's definitely great to use as far as your muscle pains, um, maybe a sprained ankle, things that you would normally use a heating or cooling pad for. So do your own research and see if it's right for you, but otherwise there will be a link in the description so you can go ahead and get one for yourself. And don't forget to apply the coupon code. I'm not sure how long it's going to be good for, so grab it while you can while it's on sale.